Uh, today I want to talk about what we call YPA breed. Why is breed so important in the business? The breed is so important because it makes life easy. Profits that you should have made in five years or three years, you make them in just months. This is all because we have the best breed. Let me tell you, if you're going to marry, you have to look for the best family around. And if you're going to make something, you have to get the best raw material so that you get the best product. So why is it that when it gets to agribusiness, we don't look for the best breed so that we can get the best product, which is dollars. The products of the goats are not meat, shoes, uh, maybe jackets and what. The product is money. Long gone are the days where we work for only passion, love, what we want or what we think we know. We only these days work to get money. When we see goats, we don't see animals. We don't see domestic animals. We see slaves making us money. When someone says, you let your money work for you, you use the money, the little money you have earned to work for you, they mean that invest it in a living creature, a living creature that will work 24-7. I mean, 24, remember the Bible says that on the seventh day, please always rest. But never shall this go to rest. Every day it is making money for me. So, my dear friend, if you want to get the best money, you have to get the best breed. Why is breed so important? Because it cuts the time. And time is money. Remember, life is time and time is money. So it means you have two things with just cutting time. You have life, which means you're going to get more time for you to enjoy yourself, more time to enjoy the money, and more time to get more money. So, when you buy the best breed, that is, for example, if you're doing meat, I can uh, recommend the YPA breed. It grows very fast. In six months, it weighs up to 35 kgs. Between 30 and 35 kgs. Six months. So it means if your kids were born today, in six months, you have over 500,000 ready waiting for you. And this goat produces two times a year. So you can get 35 in the six months, you get another 35 in the other months. So it means in one year, one goat has given you a million shillings. One year. A goat of 500,000 has given you one million as profits. So you cut off maybe like 100,000 for the maintenance of that goat and you have your 900. So let's say you have invested 50 million. Each, 50, each million is going to bring you two millions. Each million is bringing two millions. So 50 millions are going to make you 100 millions. 100 millions cut on the cost, you have at least 90 millions from 50 millions in just one year. These are very log these are not logical things or aspects of life. These are things very tangible that you can count using yourself because a goat produces two times a year. It has a gestation period of five months and three weeks. But these five months will not help you if you have the worst breed, a breed that takes four years to weigh up to 35. A local goat can weigh 20 kgs after six years, can weigh 30 kgs after 10 years. <laughs> that is, I think, even when it has, done, it has died because the lifespan of the goat is always um, eight years. So make sure you use your little money to make more money by buying the right breed and from the right source. Never should you ever think of going to the community markets and collect goats for farming. Only collect those goats for, I don't know what, but those goats, someone sees their goats are sick, they take them to the community markets. No one, no good farmer, no farmer who knows what he does will ever take goats to the community market. Now, just imagine I have my 1,000 goats and I take them to the community market. It will flood. You understand? And two, these goats I invest in a lot to go there and look for... Because whoever has the market, whoever has a demand for goats, they will always look for those people who have more goats, who have goats in big numbers, and who have quality goats. How do you know someone has quality goats? One, they are good breeds. 
two, they are not products of inbreeding, which is uh, very, 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 very common in many farmers who don't know what they are doing. And this is very bad that kills even good, good genetics are destroyed, are killed because of inbreeding. So you find a brother mating with a sister or a mother, uh, or rather a father mating with a, a daughter. So the products, they are not good products or they are products of inbreeding and they have not been managed well. They have not been managed well. So if they have not been managed well, if they have not been managed well, my dear friend, you cannot have good goats. Because even when the breed is very good and you do not manage it well, you lose. So that is why at YPA we advise you that after sourcing good breeds from good sources, then get professionals who know at least what they do. If you want your business to be managed well, why do you think billionaires always hire professionals maybe with masters and degrees and what? Those transcripts, those Expert, that expertise, whoever takes uh, their, wi their, their, their wife to give birth from someone in Kayembe, why don't you do that? It is because you want the expertise of this uh, gynecologist to help you get, to help you get the best out of this woman. So get a professional, let him help you manage or train your people, just know how to use that currency. Just know, plant it. Money is a tool that we should invest all the time and make money. These slaves, you see, this guy is chewing. This is not a farm. He is not feeding. He is not doing anything, but he is chewing. What is he chewing? He is chewing to make more money. So they don't rest. They make money all the time. They make money all the time. Why are they making money all the time? Because this is their role and you don't pay them. You don't have to tie them so that they can feed. When they feed, you get money. My dear friend, here is what you have to do. Get good breeds, get a professional and get enough feeds. Good breeds, a professional and enough feeds. That is why we have improvised, we have become a, a, an agriculture center, agribusiness center actually, where you can pick all the types of grasses that you want. Types of grasses with good, good nutrients that they can act, they can help you service this goat as though it was in the bush getting the natural ingredients. People in South Africa are making money and they don't have what we have. They will never have what we have. It is only because that we are sleeping, today we import goats from South Africa. In 10 years from now, we want to make them import goats from Uganda. They will do that because we are going to start exporting goats to Kenya, to Egypt. And right now we are exporting these goats uh, in form of meat. But in the later days, we are going to be exporting goats, live goats. Why is that so? Because goats have become very, 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 very useful. They have become a very good machine that makes money. It is a factory. Goats are a factory that they manufacture money while you are sleeping. 24 hours are not hours for us to work. 24 hours are hours for us to manage. So we should invest in the goats and we'll thank, you will thank me 